Drivers will be busy through the night as the roads become more slippery, including in Williston, and that's where we find NBC5's Carolyn Sistran. It's been coming down for hours now. How does it look out there right now? Yeah, Bright Alice, I think I chose the wrong place to stand because the wind has picked up in the last hour and it's just hitting me in the face pretty hard. But I want to show you um, the snow that's come down and added to what was already here from the previous few storms. It's about like halfway, maybe a little more up my calf right now. So good accumulation if you want to go out and sled and have a snowball fight. Not so great for the roads. There is a pretty nice coat of it here on Route 2 in Williston and we haven't seen many plows in the last hour coming by. So it's definitely tricky, but some people say they're excited to see more snow. For little guys like Simon and Forrest. What's your favorite part of the snow? Having snow like go! Snow means finding the best hill in town. These kids in Williston say it's the one next to the Immaculate Heart of Mary Church off Williston Road. It's right here, right between Williston Central and Allenbrook. It's the perfect location. This is why I moved back to Vermont this year with my family. I grew up here and then we've been away for a while and now we're back because we wanted all the snowy winter. For anyone having to drive in this Wednesday into Thursday, they may not have as smooth of a trip as I did taking a ride on this sled. Sometimes it takes our plow trucks two complete hours to make a route. For this third round of snow in the last week, the Vermont Agency of Transportation is deploying 70 snow fighting vehicles. Probably reduced to around 20, 15 ish throughout the overnight hours, and then at uh, 3 and 4 a.m., we'll bring it back up. Back in Williston. And they all have their plow routes, and they just start going at it. The town's Department of Public Works has eight trucks ready to roll. We have 72 miles of road in the town of Williston. Ten of those are gravel roads, so that takes one of our trucks, because we don't put salt on those roads, that truck is totally sand. So the other 62 miles is split up against those other seven trucks. While the winter weather will have many state and town employees working through the night, these guys are looking forward to waking up to more fresh snow for sledding and maybe some for eating. And Forrest tells me he loves eating the snow. He calls them snow snacks. I don't know if that's a thing or if people knew that that was a name. Maybe it's just his, but that's what I'm going to start calling it. And the town of Williston is also telling you if you're going out to shovel your driveway, please do not put that extra snow into the road. It's actually against state and town ordinances. So don't be doing that. You'll get yourself in some trouble. Also, don't put your trash cans out if you want to take your trash out because they say that's a surefire way to lose your trash can while the plows are out there working. In Williston, Carolyn Sistran, NBC5 News.